Okay, hello, friends and neighbors. Uh, this is Scooby Sprite from Best Learners Games Podcast. Uh, it's being recorded for you on Friday, the 24th of February, 2017. So, 2017-02-27. Uh, we are going to play a little Gradius 5 using PCSX2 PlayStation Emulator on our Mint 18 box. And uh, this is something that this represents a lot of different technologies that I thought would never, ever work together i uh, go way back in terms of gaming so you know uh i downloaded pcs 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 x2 uh found a good rom set for the bios which is easy just google around and then found my favorite game gradius 5 of which i still own a copy um and so we're gonna play us some gradius 5 i have it set to full I'm trying out like a relatively full screenish kind of thing here, so we shall see. Uh, and I have this is I have three monitors running. Um, I'm actually not 3D printing on one, but I have a bunch of 3D applications running. So anyway, we'll do boot re, uh, reboot CD DVD fast. I might need to, yeah, don't show that again. And I'm just going to check real fast that we have audio. Vic Viper has become unstuck in time. T3101. Now, of course, it normally runs in 640 by 480 or whatever. Oh, yeah, we get signal. Um, So you're going to have... It's going to look not as good when you make it 1080 or 1920 by 1080 like it's like it is here. This is a great intro. You're going to love this. Get paper. And finding uh, the ISOs for your games is not going to be difficult. You want to work them yourself. Um, this is the only game I've tried, uh, but I'm, this is for this week's episode of the podcast, episode, uh, 222, www.bestlinuxgames.com. Oh my god, there's so many of them! Stay on target! Signals are fucking rad. And of course, I'm recording the video. Like, I am the Dr. Parker. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, I am there. Knock, knock. I'm sorry, you're already dead. So, I have to say, without pause, uh, 20 years, uh, almost 20 years of Linux now, and a lot more than 20 years in emulation, uh, starting with OG main back in the day, and then um, over the last uh, 10 years, getting way hardcore back into emulation. This, even though it's PlayStation 2, is emulation process I've ever experienced setting up a controller block PSX2 PCSX2 oh my god so good it's crazy select weapon already this is one of my picks for the greatest shooter of all time, and it's been since 2004 since I've been able to play it. Um, because I get a
cool because this all started a while ago too. Our name is Big Viper, our gift is 301. Right there, you heard it! You have to get unstuck in time if we're gonna fuck it. Man, I'll live in the last few seconds. You don't know what I'm talking about? Go download the game. The best Gradius game. Come on, we're just getting started. Please He's not continue. kidding either. Uh, in numerous Eight. ways, you know, one of the most difficult games Seven. ever made. Hang Six. Uh, Five. Four. Where is. Three. Two. One. in a virtual machine so we're gonna shut that down let's try loading slot one exactly where we left it pretty bug free artifact each there but uh yeah um all of this in homage to uh the magnificent work done by which you can get on Steam, and that's what we'll be covering this week. I think. What the fuck? Since when do I have? I don't remember that at all. Um. Um. Let's see if. F3 is load state. Okay. Let's see if we just if we just press F3. I don't think so. Sorry. 
So, you got some PS2 games you want to play. And by the way, just looking through the list of games for PlayStation 2 is a system that almost lasted a decade and dominated pretty much all of that decade in terms of major games that were available for it. You run Linux, PSX2, and I think it's cross-platform, but I don't give a fuck about your Windows. I don't give a shit about your... Oh, I especially don't give a shit about your Mac iOS. Oh, whatever your Apple iOS, whatever the fuck madness is. I don't even develop for that fucking... I don't even use Xcode anymore. Refuse to deal with it. Anyway, so that's even less relevant. But, fantabulous. Fucking rock on. Huge number of games. You heard here first. And then finally, which I kept trying to say while getting my ass kicked. Astroport is a great developer. I swear to God, it's like one Japanese guy who's like my age. He's like 36, 38, maybe 42, somewhere in there. What? Um, trapped in a closet in Japan who is devoted to remaking, but not remaking, like soup to nuts remaking. Not like in a frame by frame, like we're going to reshoot Psycho um, remaking, but like taking the best elements out of the best most obscure shooters, two-dimensional shooters of all variety, from Raiden to R-Type to um, uh, Cybernator, which if you want to talk about emulation, get yourself a ROM with Cybernator, play that for your Super NES. Anyway, all he does is like make these great new games based off of those premises. The Not the premises, but the actual um, shooter mechanics that are in those games, the gameplay elements, um, yeah, yeah, so, uh, this week we're gonna be talking about, a little bit more about Zangeki Warp, Z-A-N-G-E-K-I Warp, which is, uh, Astro Ports, um, it's their first, it's their first, it's their most polished, it's their fifth game, he makes them all available for Linux, there's only one release that he's ever, that they've ever done that's not been for Linux, um, it's not been Linux compatible, I should say. But uh, Zengeki Warp is the best and most polished, most recent, and also comes closest to creating a really huge, um, huge... This is a no-Trump zone, by the way, so sorry about that. But um, Zengeki Warp incorporates all the standard R-type stuff with the ability to warp from point to point, stopping time. So the ultimate game design... The ultimate game comes out from a design perspective as being like a cross between Indiana Jones, The Matrix, slash um, Max Payne, slash R-Type, slash Gradius, um, slash, uh, there's a game that recently came out that um, was entirely new. It's one of my shooters of the year two years ago. Anyway, check out this week's episode of the podcast for that. My name is Skooky Sprite, S-K-O-O-K-I-E-S-P-R-I-T-E. Find me on Steam, find me on Steam, and go to www.bestlinuxgames.com to find more Best Linux Game stuff. Cheers, thanks for watching.